other. Do you believe the best foundation for love is friendship? It is rare, but you must follow your heart. What is the primary force that guides us along our paths? Penelope. Is it our minds or our hearts? Things are heating up between Penelope and Colin in Bridgerton season three. I've been a huge fan of Penelope's for a long time, so I'm excited to see her have her story told. How would you describe the season in one word? Romantic. It's so romantic. Yeah, romance is coming for the longtime pals. The season three trailer just dropped, and fans get a glimpse of Penelope, aka Lady Whistledown's journey to find love. I cannot live at home any longer. I must take a husband. Does my lady have a suitor in mind? Is that it's our brother? Oh. Well, it's good to see you. Is it? Something wrong. Seems as though every Bridgerton was born to attract notice. For some of us, notice is very slight. If a husband is what you seek, let me help you. Are we not friends? Friends. Yep, Penelope's longtime crush helps her find a suitor. I should like to see your skills as they are first. How delightful to see you all. The splendid weather we are having. I would not be angry if you found me to be a lost cause. You must not say such things. You are Penelope Featherington. Do not forget that. While there's a possible match for Penelope... You look especially beautiful tonight, Miss Featherington. Colin discovers he's got feelings for her, too. She's not seeking a husband in you, I hope. No, I'm only helping her find one. Since when are you worried about Penelope? I keep saying season one was about longing, season two was about... No, season one was about... Passion. Season two is about longing, season three is romance. Yeah, Nicola Coughlin's tease to E.T. that it's only gonna get steamier between Colin and Penelope. And those scenes weren't easy to film with co-star Luke Newton. Luke and I, I read the books at the beginning in season one and it was funny to us. We were like, ha, imagine if we have to kiss and do this stuff. Ha, ha. And then when season three came around, we were like, oh God. And then it's like, it's my friend. I have to kiss my friend and you can't pretend kiss someone. You have to really kiss them. And um, it's a spicy one. There's one day where we had to sort of do like a very romantic, like beautifully very romantic scene. And we were just I, like peeing ourselves with laughter because we just have to like look into each other's eyes and we were like, oh God. Um, yeah. As for what Bridgerton creator Shonda Rhimes says of this new season? If you had to describe that in three adjectives, what would you say? Witty, intellectual, and emotional, and sexy. What this author knows to be true is that diamonds are not the only gems that sparkle.